So what are the best exercises for getting rid of a gut or leaning out your midsection or getting toned abs or ripped abs or whatever? It might sound like a broken record here, but the truth is there are no exercises that will do virtually anything for the fat tissue on your midsection, the visibility of your abs or how lean your midsection is. This is entirely dependent on diet. Uh, muscle mass will play a huge role in this too. So today I was asked this question by um, an older an older woman. Um, I believe she's probably about 60 years old at this point, a little over 60 years old. And uh, she was asking about walking or <laughs> hysterically walking with weights to get help get rid of her gut, she called it. Or which exercise would help her get rid of her gut. So I uh, told her that there aren't any. And the reason a lot of older women and older men suffer from this unsightly gut is because they're losing muscle tissue over time and eating like shit. Um, their, their metabolism is just not efficient. They, they pretty much created or horm a hormonal environment conducive to just fat storage and pretty much sending no energy and no substrate, no nutrients to the muscle tissue. Uh, this particular individual, um, you know, drinks often. <laughs> and in high volumes and that's another thing too older individuals you know, a lot of times once they retire they start to drink they eat like shit they don't really watch it and they have a hard time getting rid of their gut because of that so you know the only way to get rid of your gut really is simply you have to reduce your calories you have to reduce your calories relatively slightly over a long period of time and slowly chip away at all the fat on your entire body and eventually your midsection will go. What exercises should you do to help with this? Well, no abdominal exercises are going to help with this because you're simply just working the muscle tissue underneath the fat tissue. It's not gonna help with appearance of your midsection or definition at all whatsoever. Unless you're like 6% body fat, abdominal exercises really do nothing. So the exercises you want to do is exercises which build lean muscle tissue, resistance training, you want to implement resistance training along with a calorie restricted diet to reduce fat tissue and increase muscle tissue. Not only are you going to increase muscle tissue, which is going to give you better definition, your tissues are in competition for nutrients. So if you're placing a heavy demand on your muscle tissue, what's gonna happen is more the nutrients, more the substrate is gonna be shunted towards muscle tissue and less likely to be stored as fat. So it's gonna cr create a hormonal environment conducive to fat loss instead of a hormonal environment conducive to fat gain. So the, the role exercise plays in fat loss is not so much burning the fat, it's changing the hormonal environment, changing the particular enzyme profile in your body so that way you can create an environment which will make it less likely to store fat, more likely to burn fat, and more likely to build and preserve muscle tissue as the fat is lost through calorie deficit. Now this applies to men, women, old, young, doesn't matter. If you are overweight, if you have a gut, you need to restrict your calories. And if you don't want to end up skinny fat, you need to resistance train. How do you resistance train? Well, the high intensity training approach is the best because, because it's the safest and the most efficient. While pretty much all training approaches, if done with enough intensity, will lead to the same result, High intensity training will get you there with less time involved without screwing your joints up in the process. So plenty of ways to approach high intensity training. If you're a woman or if you're a man and you want to get rid of your fat or have a little bit of gut, a little bit of a gut, scroll through my channel, look at the exercises I do, or if you train at home, check out my uh, high intensity training home workout. It's a series of a ton of video demonstrations with explanation of exercises you can do at home with virtually no equipment, body weight, couple of dumbbells. I also created a home TRX high intensity training workout. Again, huge series of video demonstrations and explanations with TRX exercises used with a high intensity training approach, meaning the TRX exercise is done more effectively, more safely, and more efficiently. So resistance training plus calorie restricted diet, and you will eventually get rid of your gut. But don't expect it to happen in two, four, six weeks. It's going to take you several months, especially depending on how old you are and how much fat tissue you have. All right. 
So for more information on science-based approaches to training, please like and subscribe, bell notification icon, and follow me on Instagram, underscore J, underscore Vincent.